The interesting thing is the the zikr, the practice of zikr, is all about interacting with this uh, um, unchanging, unknowable God. When we say that there is nothing but God, then that which we think of as God exists within this greater umbrella, this greater presence that is that unchanging, unknowable God. And when we alter our consciousness somewhat, something happens that is both magic and mysterious. When we create just the right um, akasha, just the right s vibrations, somehow the unknowable doesn't become known because it can't, but the unknowable, the all-pervading, actually affects the, um, the changeable universe. So what we're doing on the path, as I said at the beginning, this will really help us in our life, is we are constantly attuning our mind, our heart, our consciousness, our habits, our, our awareness to um, create just the right form so that the formless can be present in it. We can remember that our practice is to remember. But we think of remember as, I will think of God. That means I'm remembering God. It's not thinking of God. That's a, a practice with the manifest God. The other, after you've pulled back a little bit from feeling, which actually creates more compassion, by the way, not less, um, the other is to remember God, to give permission, to give permission for the, um, the mystery to occur within your own realm of consciousness. That you give permission to not understand life. I don't believe that mysticism is about understanding life. It's not about understanding. Many of you know the external zikr, this is not my body, this is the temple of God. What does this really mean? I am the temple. I'm not the worshiper, I'm the temple. I can make the temple so beautiful I can make the temple so clean, I can make the temple so alive that I will willingly invite in the worshiper. The worshiper is the, the unknowable God. So what happens is we actually lose control of our life. But first, we need to gain control. We need to clean the temple, so to speak. We need to perfect it and beautify it. And then once we have that somewhat, then we give the key away and allow the unformed to be present.